In the nation's capital, a bipartisan bill fronted by Oklahoma Senator James Lankford aims to pass the first major immigration reform in at least 30 years. But as Two News Oklahoma's Samson Tamajani shows us, other Oklahoma representatives and even Lankford himself acknowledge that this legislation might not pass. Senator Langford is joined by two other senators, Arizona Independent Kirsten Sinema and Connecticut Democrat Chris Murphy for negotiating the bill, for which would also guarantee funding to help Ukraine in its war. But its primary focus is capping immigration through the U.S.-Mexico border. We need to find a solution. We have a major problem on our border. We need to solve it. Senator James Langford says he worked four months to draft a bipartisan immigration bill. Endorsed by the Border Patrol Union, the deal would allow a president to close the southern border to any migration if crossings rise above 5,000 per day in a given week or 8,500 in a single day. Migrants could still apply at ports of entry, and once the average of illegal crossings dropped by 75 percent, the administration would have two weeks to reopen the border. The rule would apply to all migrants, even those seeking asylum, who would then face stricter requirements to gain asylum. Human rights groups say that goes too far, but many Republicans say the proposals don't go far enough, like Congressman Josh Burkeen. The premise for them to obtain legal entry into our country needs to be upon the justice of their claim, not coming across and then us, you know, granting them, again, through, through taxpayer utilization. President Biden says he'd sign it into law if it passed Congress and says it's former President Trump's fault for encouraging Republicans to strike it down for election points. House Speaker Mike Johnson already said last month Lankford's bill would be, quote, dead on arrival. Despite growing backlash, Lankford says now is the time to act. It would be an enormous shift, not just for this president or the next president, but for the next one, the next one, the next one. As a lawmaker, I have a responsibility to look on the long horizon and say, what do we do to fix an obvious hole? This is an obvious hole in the law. Let's fix it. Senate Minority Leader Mitch McConnell praised Lankford today for his efforts to draft the bill, but acknowledged it likely won't pass this week. However, McConnell refused to comment whether he thinks Trump is the reason for the bill's opposition. In studio, Samson Tamajani, 2 News, Oklahoma. Langford bill, Langford's bill also comes as the House of Representatives is set for its own vote today on whether to impeach Secretary of Homeland Security Alejandro Mayorkas for how he's handled the border crisis.